Is there vanilla in here? Spend it. Uh. Yo. Oh, this lighting is good. This area is so tragic. such a busy day so i've had such a busy day and it's 2 17 i haven't eaten yet i literally was on a call and i had to run and get my DoorDash at the door and and like who has time to make anything no one has time for that you understand what i'm saying i had i worked out today and i was dragging all this all that and then i had 40 minutes to get ready for a meeting i knew i had the meeting but the time just flew by and I ran quickly, went and showered, did my makeup so fast. I almost didn't even do lashes, but you know, it makes them look. Okay, so I did my lashes and then I had that meeting. Then I filmed a few TikToks, TikTok slash reels, and then I filmed a YouTube video. Then I sat down and I ordered my DoorDash and it obviously didn't come in time and I had a meeting. I just finished it. Thank God the meeting was 15 minutes because my stomach is turning. I'm so hungry. So I'm going to go heat up my food. Eat, my mouth is like watering heat up my food eat my food and then i gotta go pick up me from school and i actually wanted to take him i'm gonna take him out we'll go just like out just be out it's just so nice outside too nice to be sitting inside so I'll take him out and then have dinner out and then that'll be my that'll be my uh friday but when i tell you i am tired just from all the go 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 just tired and hungry so i cannot wait to eat and this outfit is from shein it's pants i just did content with it but i'm going to show you here it's this crop top pant situation i like it it's big on me you know i buy a 1x14 and i've lost weight so it is big on me but i like how it falls because it just falls to the ground you know the pants it just falls nicely anyway let me uh, go heat up my food I brought the makeup kit that's in my bathroom that I use when I'm filming in my bathroom and what I'm going to do is change out these products for some new products that I want to give a test drive to in my bathroom. I've been filming my bathroom a lot lately. I'm just loving it. This this sponge is so done it ain't even funny so right in the trash that's a problem for me. All right so let me take out I'm going to give this away. You know, there's just so much stuff. I can't keep all of it. I can't use all of it. So there are things that I'm going to just give away. And then there are things that I'm going to put into my kit because I want to keep them. Alrighty. I'm going to keep all this one and done because what in the world? Oh, I've been binging on this. Still loving it. Honestly, I've been powdering my face before putting this on and it is controlling the shine i know i know i do have another fenty foundation though that i do want to use so now i don't know if i should give this a rest or not i just love it so much oh my gosh all right this bronzer i'm gonna keep excuse me it's a contour powder these blush okay for blush i'm gonna take these two out love them not gonna give them away or anything. i love them so putting them there and i'm gonna give this blush right here a spin from lys it's a cream to powder i hope it dries down really powdery because i don't want it to be dewy i can't stand dewy blush all right so let's put that there and see what that's talking about face powder gotta stay this i want to give a few more test drives to i did use it in LA when I did the get right with me but I want to give some more test drives so maybe I should take out the HD situation and put this here because with having both of them I have been 
defaulting to this one because I just love it so much. So let me give that a rest. Let me give this Fenty a rest also. I'm taking this out. I like it a lot. This is what I was putting on my face before the foundation and it's so good, but it's sold out or discontinued. So using it's a problem because when y'all want it, I, I can't link it for you. This, however, I believe is the replacement. So let me give that a try. I'm gonna still continue using this. What is this? KBD Good Apple to contour because it is so good. Brushes need to be clean, but I'm not about to do that. Not right now. Setting powder. I'm going to use this one from Say. Have you used it? Comment and let me know. I have not. So that'll be good. <clears throat> this is a new lash glue. So that's good. I have been enjoying these Lawless concealers, yo. Really enjoying them. Put these down here. Dang it. That thing is... Oh, it's making a mess. This thing is broken. It's broken. It's annoying me. I've been enjoying these Lowe's concealers, yo. I love using the darker color to conceal under my brow. And then a lighter one to conceal my face. So good. I have too many products in here, though. So I need to take some stuff out. I'm going to leave this, conceal this mascara. See, I got all these concealers down here for no reason. It's too many. Oh, it's a mess down there. It's too many. So I'm going to take these concealers out just like this. all this stuff that ends up adding up in here and then i'm not even using it take this boing one out very light and we keep those you know use them another time now all my lookies over here let's see now i did add this blush this orange one here i still want to use it these lippies gotta go oh my god my tried and true chai genius and savage if you see the the if you've seen the video on ig then you know if you know you know i'm gonna keep this though because it is such a great outline blending type color i'm gonna put these away because i want to try some other lips out this one is new i want to try this this is orange let me take this red out take this pink one out this one oh my gosh i have so many lippies in here I love lippies, but it's so hard to use them. Jeez. Take this Mario one out. I got to rotate through, y'all. I got to rotate through. All right. So we got that. I don't do gloss often, but whatever. I'm putting this Milani one in here. So nice. Can't wait to use it. And I'm going to put this MAC one in Tom Ford gloss. Let me take this gloss. Take these two brushes out. The... the the least amount of options I have will force me to use what I have. When I have too many, then there's some that get lost in here. I never use them. It's a waste of time. It's, it's annoying. And then I have these different lippies from Bobbi Brown. I hate that you can't see the color on the outside. That's annoying to me, but they're different colors. I already looked at them to verify. I'll take this eyeshadow palette out with... Oh, I love it. It's such an everyday online. Let me keep it. <laughs> hold on, hold on. All right, this is another concealer. Although now I look at it, I have these two lawless ones. What am I going to do with this? I think they're the same. I don't know. Okay, I'm just putting that there. All right, I got this Tom Ford primer. So I'm going to put this back. I don't need this right now. I'll try this for one another time. Brow pencils are here. And eye eyeliner is there. This is an eyeshadow primer. I'm going to try that this is a, an eyeshadow topper i'm gonna try that here's a sponge for un, for my under eye but i do need another one for the blush right i need a sponge for the blush okay i'll get that and then i have these from this company what's it called per per, per i don't know <laughs> these ink velvet situations see look now i have too many lippies now I literally have too many lippies in here. Oh, I got to make sure I make my way through these. And then I've been wanting to try this. So I'm going to see what I, what I decide to do with it. I don't know. You know, I love to do my highlighter with Rare Beauty. So I'm going to figure out how I'm going to highlight with this. This is just tried and true, honey. So that one has to stay. Oh, and like I said, this one going to stay because it's a perfect color to put around the lips to blend, baby. And then I don't be setting too much when I'm in the bathroom getting ready, but I do have my all-nighter. Put that there. And yeah, that's it for now. This is the kit for the bathroom. What up, girl? Okay, so this humongous package came in and I do not know why, nor do I know what's inside. <laughs> what I do know is that it says fragile, handle with care. And from 
the writing on it. It looks like it's from Malay. Malay? I think it's called Malay. I don't know what this is. I don't know why they would send me such a humongous package. So let's see what's up in here because this is very, very curious. This is the biggest package I've ever received. And what could be so fragile? Jesus. Oh my God. Look at this thing. What is this? It is from Malay. Uh oh. Oh my God. Okay, let's take this out. Oh, look at this. All shades of black, brown, and olive are worth celebrating. Oh my gosh. Towels, a robe, oh. skincare. Okay, this is so nice. Wow. What? Towels. Are these probably hair towels? Maybe. Oh my god. Oh, there's a candle in here. We got a forever mood candle. Hold on. Oh my god. Oh, this is my first skincare fridge. It's a skincare fridge. Oh my god. And a mirror. Oh my god. This is so nice. <laughs> Yo. I've never. This is so nice. Oh, you know. Listen, Jackie is doing a daggone thing with the placements, okay? You better go ahead and place yourself in this box. There are PR packages, and then there are PR packages, mind you. I took my lashes off in case you're wondering what's going on. I'm about to go wash this face off. I'm just tired. Okay, so this area is so tragic, overflowing with stuff. In fact, there are items in here I need to throw away. They've just been here for too long. So I'm going to put what I'm going to salvage from here into the skincare fridge. And then I'm going to put the skincare fridge here because I just like, it's just, this place is an eyesore, but it's functional. So it just has to be, but I'm going to put everything in here and make it look better. So let's do that. This is the inside though. Oh, so cute. Melee, thank you so much. I'm just in awe. So I have these Murad and Dr. Zion Retinol Youth Renewal Eye Masks that I've been using. Love these, they're huge. They fit the eye so perfectly. I'm gonna put these in here. These are new. I know that obviously these are not old. I'm getting rid of, like I said, stuff that's just old, girl. So these are gonna go right in here. What I can say is I have way too much stuff, okay. All right, here is the Laneige, this is new, Waterbank Blue Hyaluronic Cream Moisturizer. I'm gonna put this in here somewhere. I don't even know. I don't know, let me let me pull out what I'm gonna keep and then organize it somehow. This, this is basically done. Dermalogica Circular Hydration Serum. I've been enjoying this for long lasting hydration. I tried this again and true enough, I do like it. It has mint in it. So when I tried it, I recognized that my skin was sensitive. And for that reason, the mint was burning me. It's just so invigorating, it was too much. But I do like it, it smells really good. And it's just a fun, it's a fun product to use. This I haven't used yet, Sulawasu First Care Activating Serum. But let's put the serum in one area, spray, cream, and let's pull out other stuff. Look at all these eye masks, or face masks, excuse me, that I just have over there that I've wanted to use that I haven't used. It's just excessive, it's just too much. So I need to go put those in my studio because it's too much. And then these are eye patches from Comfort Zone. Also gonna put these here. Curology, definitely need to keep this because it's my prescription, a must. Eye cream, this is a retinol eye cream, a face, oh, it's retinol face stick. I never even tried it, jeez. Okay, this Dermalogica Age Bright Active Clearing Serum is good, I've used it in the past, I just never finished this. Fresh Lotus Youth Preserve Moisturizer. I've had this here for a while, but I never actually used it. The Glow Recipe Plum, no, Watermelon Glow Niacinamide Dew Drops. I never actually used it, but I've had it here. It's all dusty. This is the problem, see? Just dust. I do want to use it. Oh, gosh. 
I bring stuff here and I know I want to use it and then I don't know I don't have time it's like overloaded La Mer moisturizing soft cream obviously like duh I've used it several times I'm gonna still keep it here I want to make my way through it I want this plumping pillow facial this is basically done but I hate to waste so I'm going to keep this and try to finish it Dermalogica Awaken Peptide Eye Gel. Been using this too, it's just about done. These are from Thayer's and I have been using their face wash, but never made it around to the face mist and the facial toner. I still wanna use it eventually one day, so I'm gonna put them over here and I'm gonna put it in my studio and I'll grab it when I can. This is just about done, but not finished yet and this stuff is really good, so we're not gonna waste. This is the Dermalogica Daily Microfoliant. Don't wanna waste that good stuff there. Never got around to this Caudalie Premier Crew Serum put it here because I wanted to and just having not around to it so all right I never finished the fresh rose deep hydration oil infused serum really good too <laughs> like oh my gosh never finished the Ben Nye excuse me the Ula Henriksen excuse me banana bright eye cream goodness gracious this is basically done inky list hyaluronic serum but there's a little bit left I can't waste this so I'm gonna keep that this little bit left Dermalogica multi-active toner spf this light looks weird hang on and then this is dermalogica moisturizer this is basically done it's done this is not getting cold what's going on here oh there's a power button got it now it's on okay it wasn't on this oil i actually just recently used charlotte tilbury i enjoy it I used it my last step never got around to this pacifica vegan ceramide serum so gonna have to try that obviously someday definitely did use this super goop daily goes daily dose vitamin c and spf serum which i did enjoy just never finished it enjoy this inky list omega water cream it's definitely light and hydrating great for daytime i was using this First A Beauty oil minimizing toner with salicylic acid, great for the T zone to control oil. It doesn't not too harsh on the skin at all. This is all dirty, but I never finished it. Oh my gosh! Then we have the First A Beauty hemp oat and hemp seed oil as a last step option. Never finished it. Recently started using this pharmacy 10% waterless vitamin C serum. Do enjoy it. It is oil. I like this a lot. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna use this one time. Dermalogica Daily Glycolic Cleanser. So this is a brightening cleanser. I never got to finish it. Oh my goodness, Polish choice. Oh, this is almost done. 2% 2 BHA, 2% 2 BHA. I almost wanna say AHA. Isn't it AHA as well? Okay, this is an exfoliating salicylic acid product. Great for T-zone, great for oily areas, great for acne, etc. So this is almost done, but not yet. So I do want to finish that. This is old, so I'm going to get rid of it. This is the first A Beauty Retinol Serum. This is, I think this is old too. The first A Beauty Calamine Pore Purging Mask. Yeah, like old meaning I used it last year around this time. So I'm just going to get rid of that. Never used this. No, did I use this? I don't know. It looks dirty, so it look like, <laughs> looks like I did use it. The Caudalie Ver Vernegetic. C plus mask. Did I use this? Oh my god, I did use it. I don't remember. <laughs> it's been so long. I used it one time, obviously. Jesus, lamb. All right, well, it's basically full, so I'm not gonna get rid of this. I want to use it. And if you hear banging, that's you me kicking the soccer ball against the wall. Praise the Lord. This is lactic acid treatment from Sunday Riley Good Jeans. This is a year old for sure. Yes, this is old. I have another one of these. This is really good. I have another one and this is old, so I'm gonna throw it away. I hate that, cause look at it, barely, barely, ugh. but it's old. When you look at the bottom, the cap that's open, the picture, the emblem or whatever you wanna call it, indicates that once it's opened, it expires in 12 months, so that is old. This is old also. I know I opened this a long time ago. Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow Sleeping Mask. I did enjoy it, it's just old. La Mer Moisturizing Cream. This one is not old, but it's getting up there. This expires, okay, two years. So, no, not getting up there quite yet. Kate Somerville Firming Serum. I opened this a while ago too, and I haven't finished it. 12 months. Ooh, it's been a year. Okay, this gotta go, and it's full, Jesus. Oh God, okay. This one, Retinol Eye Stick. I opened this a while ago too. Ooh, where's the expiration? 12 months. This is definitely old, so this is gonna go in the garbage. And then I have these Dr. Dennis Gross Alpha Beta Extra Strength Daily Peels. I like the gentle one because these really, really work. And when I used the Extra Strength one, I broke out. Just contact dermatitis, so it's really, really good. But my skin was too sensitive for it, so I'm gonna give these away, but use the extra gentle ones that I have in my studio.
Okay, now I'm back in the studio. I purchased this days ago from the Sephora sale, right? And it was the same day delivery purchase. It was a same day, not the, because I made several same day delivery purchases. And now that I socked up on the first A Beauty ingrown bump, ingrown hair pads, a must, right? For the groin and the armpits, take away the bacteria, eliminate the odor. When you sweat, no funk, you know the whole deal. We've discussed this a million times. Such a must, I got three of them, $20 with 20% off. Ooh, I can smell the apple. Okay. And then I got the YSL black, no, not black gold theme, excuse me. Illicit green. I almost didn't get it. It was in my wish list. I was going to just get it later. And then somebody commented and was like, no, no, you got to get it, girl. So here I am now and I can, it smells like green apple, like a, like a lollipop. So let's try this and see what is, what is given. I don't have the mitts in front of me, Afi. I got the small one because I have so many fragrances. Like, what in the world? Oh my gosh, I'm nervous. Am I going to like it? I better like it. Let's see. Okay. Okay. Is there vanilla in here? The box smells, so it's, it's giving me confusion. <laughs> what? Let me spray my hand. Is there vanilla in here? Hmm. Yeah, it reminds me of something that I have. The notes in here are familiar. Huh. The notes in here are so familiar. It reminds me of something that I have. Wow. Yeah, I like it though. I am going to keep it. I do smell the green apple a little subtle, so it's not so much candy. I was getting candy from the box, but not so much right now. Yeah. Okay. I like it. I'm not in love, so I am glad I got the, what is this? One ounce. I'm not jumping off of a bridge, but I do like it. It kind of has like, is it vanilla in here? Yeah, is this, is this a musk? Oh, what's going on? It's, it's interesting. Interesting. Okay. Yeah. All right. I do like it. Okay, good. I'm glad I got it. Okay, good. I mean, I'm, I'm in the process of still cleaning. This place is a mess. So while on IG, you know, the ads came through and I saw this ad for the Kayali miniature set. Then I later saw that it sold at Sephora. Well, I didn't know that. I would have used it. I would have got it at Sephora and got my points, you know what I'm saying? But I bought it from Huda's site itself. It just came in the mail. I've never had a Kayali scent, but I want to. So I figured this would be a great way to smell all of them. So, well, there's not all of them, four of them. This is Kelly Vanilla, which people always rave, always rave about. Let's give it a, a whiff. Wait, let me, get my, let me get my spray strips. Okay, this is Kelly Vanilla. Okay. It's, it's nice. It's sweet. This is really, really cute. This can go right inside the purse. All right, Kelly Vanilla is nice. She just smells like vanilla. Like, okay. This one is Kelly Deja Deja Vu White Flower. Ooh, need lower down, please. This one is good. White Flower. Ooh. Oh, it's really good. Floral, sweet, amazing. I'm definitely gonna buy a big version of this. What? White flower? Putting it, put that right here, honey. Okay, now Sweet Diamond. I almost bought a big version just because it's pink. Never smelled it. I'm curious about this pepper that's inside. You know, I like Tom Ford Rose de Chine and there's pepper in there, so let's see. Oh my God, it reminds me of Tom Ford Rose de Chine. Oh my goodness. Yo, this smells like Tom Ford Rose de Sheen. There's a slight difference, but this is a dupe for Tom Ford Rose de Sheen. Oh my God. This is out of this world. I like it. I like the pepper. Wow. This is Tom Ford Rose de Sheen, but cheaper. Tom Ford Rose Machine is 250. 
this is out of this world. Oh, I like it a lot. Wow. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. If I bought it, I would have loved it. Wow. I'm getting both of those in the big size. And this is Vanilla Coco Utopia. Ooh, I like all these travel versions. Oh, I like this one. Okay, I don't like the regular vanilla. I love this. Wow. This is reminding me of something from Victoria's Secret also, but I don't know what. Oh my goodness. The vanilla and the coconut. Wow. And it's so sweet. Oh my gosh. This 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 is fresh. This feels fresh out of the shower. What? Oh my gosh. Oh, this sale's over. I don't care. I'm going to buy these three right now. So good. Okay, so one thing about me when I travel nowadays, I bring my camera. So I brought my 90D and my lens, you know, well, if you don't know, this is the Sigma 16 to, no, 18 to 35. I have three lenses. This is one of them that I use all the time these days. And then my remote, I'll link all this below in case you care. And in my carry-on now is where I put all of my technology. So this is the case that my camera was in and then my mic and just the, a mirror to hang on to the tripod. The tripod goes right inside here, which is per because it compresses so small and then you know the mount and the microphone I'll link my tech category in Amazon in case you want it here's a tripod and it is so good let me show you how it how I get it to set up especially she reckless and be you my bestest friend yeah she my bestie my love for you is endless nobody else can end it and when I get the money back then baby girl you can spend it oh. And everything is alright I like how you doing alright, alright Like how you think alright Always on top of you Alright, so we just came down to eat at the bar And there's supposed to be live music happening soon So, let's see what happens with that Everything good alright, alright Like how you think alright Always on top of right. oh yeah I wanna know it tonight I wanna be the one to surprise you I forgot to bring a knockabout type outfit, you know, like just something just knock on when you're not actually dressed. So I actually have on my dress and my wig, which is unusual. I like to, like I said, just have on something and then get dressed and then put on my wig and my outfit. It's just the way I like to do things. So when I go back to the room, then I will do my makeup. We are back in the hotel after breakfast. That place, mm -mm. one hour to get our food, atrocious. The food was okay, it had no seasoning. I suppose they do that because you can just put salt and pepper on the food yourself, but who puts salt and pepper on their eggs? You need flavor. <sighs> like there's some places where they have flavor on the eggs and then you can doctor it with hot sauce, of course. No, it felt like they just literally made the egg and put nothing on it. So that was a problem for me. <sighs> but here we are. I'm about to take off my wig and put on my robe and then do my makeup. I cannot do my makeup with this wig on. I didn't bring any clips, so I don't have a way to clip my hair, you know? Let me show you this new brush pouch that I got on Amazon to hold my brushes in. What I like about it is that it's, is it aerated? Oh no, it's not. It just looks mesh. Okay, whatever. But what I like about it is that it does stand up. 
So it will just stand on the counter while I do my makeup and not, you know, because I used to sprawl this all out on the counter when doing my makeup, but it definitely has the sections to put everything into. So this is good. I'm gonna link this below in case you want it. It's right here standing. FYI, my curls have completely fallen since yesterday and I put hairspray in this. I think, no, I think. Yeah, I, I do think because I'm not, I'm not sure. But I have two wigs that are four by four that are black that are long like this. One of them came straight and one of them came like a body wave. So the body wave one is normally the one that I curl and it looks really cute, soft curls. And then the one that came straight, when I wash it, it does look wavy when it dries, but then I was keeping it straight but i believe i've mixed the two up i don't know which one is which so i'm here and i'm like this one fell so straight that i think that this is the one that's supposed to be straight and maybe i mixed it up because i'm like it didn't hold curls like it normally does so this must be the way that is supposed to be straight i'm so annoyed so the curls that i put in are just no longer i like this gloss from tom ford Gloss Lux Brilliant. Okay, 06 Ravish. I thought it was going to be more pigmented, but I'm glad it's not because I wanted it to still look lightly pink. My brow pencil is done. I'm so annoyed. Thank God I have Instacart. I'm about to order Instacart Sephora and get a brow pencil because if not, I'm not going to have one for tomorrow and I, I want to do my makeup tomorrow. So I'm about to order Instacart. I cannot. Thank God for Instacart because even this morning I ordered some cough medicine because Nia's coughing, as you can hear. But thank God for stuff like this because it was five in the morning when I ordered Instacart and it got here by 6.30. So praise the Lord for that. All right. All done here. All right. We're making our way now to Discovery Green. I don't know if I've ever walked around downtown before. So this is quite exhilarating. It's an empty day. It requires speeding, yeah. It's an empty day. It's nice. It's supposed to rain. I hope it doesn't because I'm obviously not ready for that. We could have done Uber, but I think it'd be nice to walk. Okay, there are no cars going. Let's go. Yeah, let's just do it. <laughs> Here we are. This place is so empty. Downtown is so empty. I don't understand. Oh, this lighting is good. Downtown is so empty. I don't understand what that means. 